Hello YouTubers, Lover Flushman here. Today gonna teach you how to make a <coughs> red cabbage juvelac. Um it's called red cabbage even though it's purple, alright, but uh so what we're gonna do is just cut off this is organic red cabbage as well, so of course organic is always the best. It's got more life force better for you. Of course everybody knows that. So it cuts them up and uh, this red cabbage rejuvelac is really easy to make. Um, most popularly people use the green cabbage to make the rejuvelac but purple also works and purple is the color of the crown chakra of, of the uh, chakras. So basically it's so easy to make all you do is add the purple cabbage to your blender and then um, add water filtered water is the best I use these glass jars and fill up the water and let it sit for 24 to 48 hours and that way it gets rid of the chlorine and some fluoride evaporates as well and a lot of times I use crystals there's no crystal in this one but I use one uh, each gemstone for the chakras and I include tourmaline, black tourmaline, which has far infrared technology. It ha sends off negative ions and it gets rid of uh, chlorine and fluoride, fluorine as well. So we add the water and uh, fill it up with the red cabbage. And really, really, after you do it, all you want to do is you only want to blend it for like two to three seconds. You don't want to blend it up really, really fine, just uh, for a second here or two. So, just like this. There we go. And, uh, and then basically that is how, that's how simple it is to make this rejuvenate. You add it to your big glass jar. And you can see the consistency of the... Uh, cabbage there and um, basically that is it now uh, I'm just gonna let this sit but you want to put a lid on top so you can either use a cloth like a cheese cloth or just a cotton rag um, another option that works well too is uh, just the coffee filters like this and then uh, put a rubber band on and the reason why you got to put the lid on is because contaminants, airborne contaminants and or fruit flies or other bugs can get in there and contaminate it and then you'll have more of a toxic drink with uh, bad ferment. So what this is, this will last, this will take about, um, uh, about seven days, uh, give or take, you know, um, some people like to do it for 12 days, 10 days depending on the strength of the rejuvelac you want. But look at that nice beautiful uh, deep purple there with the cabbage and that is how easy it is. Just cut it up, blend it up and let it sit. I mean letting it sit t is so easy. You just leave it in your kitchen and that is it. That's how to make the purple rejuvelac. Thank you. Oh and one more thing. Um, the rejuvelac drinks such as the sprouted wheat berries, uh, soft wheat berries or buckwheat, camut, um, uh, quinoa, all that stuff, all these rejuvelacs, the green cabbage and the purple and all those grain ones that you sprout, all of these are friendly bacteria fermented which creates, it's a, it's a friendly, it's a probiotic which is a friendly beneficial bacteria for the intestines and the intestines is where we absorb nutrients and over 60% of the immune system is located so drinking these drinks are really good but also doing enemas with rejuvelax uh, is a good way to promote the friendly bacteria and keep uh, overgrowth of candida and unfriendly bacteria away um, so try it yourself there you go